We made it. Think we lost the cardinal with that? I sure hope so. The cardinal's intensity was so intimidating. Is that the responsibility that comes when you carry the weight of the country? <laughs> She's just some idiot human who became a Hellion. Is she the one you need to get your vengeance on? I wouldn't know. She beat you so badly I couldn't even tell. Sorry. Don't screw up next time. I've got to get my revenge, you know. Yeah, I'll try. You sure about that? If she's the one I need to get vengeance on, it means she's dead meat. Yeah. Yeah. I guess I'll have to think about it. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks for what? I just figured you were worried about me or something. <laughs> There's no point in even thinking about it, if that's the only way you can interpret things. Right? The caverns or whatever, I mean. Cambria Caverns. He said they were south of the Meadow of Triumph. Do you really think we can get through this way? Don't worry. You sound pretty confident. Is it just a hunch? No. I can feel the wind. There's nothing in the universe cooler than a secret passageway. Especially one underground. Totally! A maze of twisty little passages with exits galore to who knows where! Like the back of a waterfall, or the bottom of an old abandoned well. Yes! Miklio gets it! Glad someone gets it, because I don't. I don't want to get it. <laughs> boys just love things like this. In this case, I don't know about boys so much as... Children, right? Ray, look carefully at the ground. There might be something nearby.
It seems there's a treasure chest near us. Wait, that's... Ray, look around you. There might be something nearby. It seems there's a treasure chest near, near us. That's... Saray, so look around you. Pick something up. There might be something nearby. There's a message from Marland. That's a big shrimp. A fossil? One hopes. Holy crap! This thing was alive once? I want to catch it and fry it. It looks terrifying. You don't think this is a hellion? There are fossilized hellions? No way! It's not outside the realm of possibility. It's not outside the realm of sashimi either. Hmm. So which side's the head? The, the left? left? We can't even tell where the head is? Ugh, this thing's freaktastic. No matter. A shrimp's head and tail are equally delicious. I can't even make sense of this thing. Shrimp. Starts with S. Look it up.
Hey, isn't that the Earth? So I guess that means that general guy was exiled? From the army? From his country? Maybe he lost a war? Just a thought. Once there had been huge crowds cheering for him. And now... It makes me wonder. There was no one at all he could turn to? That's par for the course for humans. Yeah! Quite surprising. A shepherd in an age like this. I think you've surprised us! My name is Saray, and you are? I am Syndra, Shepherd Saray. Are you the Seraph of Lastenbel? I once was, yes. Can we ask you to give your blessing again? There's no Seraph enshrined at the sanctuary in Lastenbel, and strange things are happening. That's of no relation to blessings. How can you be sure? Because I have used the bells in the Belfry as my vessel. I see. So the Sanctuary in Lastenbell is nothing more than a figurehead. In any case, it is no longer my concern. I no longer have the capacity to understand humans. Please, leave me be. May we ask you what happened? I'm sorry. We can't force her to talk. But something's up. We should do some research. You're right. Let's go ask people in Lastenbell. They may know something. There may be some herbs out here. Be on the lookout for them. Wow. Indeed. It's mesmerizing how the lake's surface sparkles. Bioluminescence, do you think? Dazzle? Don't ask me. I can't see it. So even you have some gaps in your animal knowledge? I've heard of organisms too small to be seen that give off light in the dark. Maybe this is their habitat. Whoa, thousands and thousands of tiny creatures! But each one lives only a few days before winking out. Only a few days? But they shine so bright! Biodoom, in essence. Oh, oh! That was inappropriate! I'm sorry! Don't be. Better than ending on a sour note. Oh, a left-field success from Lila! My first one, it feels like. I suppose it took going deep underground for Edna to finally... cave. And I take it back. The rare, sparkling Lila. Note its brief lifespan. Even you, Dezel? Ah.
this aroma. I think we're close to the exits. Probably. Did you feel it too? The wind? I think I kind of did. Looks like this Margaret or whatever might know something. But wasn't she bullied, though? I have a bad feeling about this. Saray, why don't we take a rest at the inn? Good idea. That's Margaret's home, besides. Not a lot of clues to her whereabouts. We know something bad happened. Maybe Syndra and Margaret had already known each other from before. So you think Margaret had such strong resonance that she could talk to Seraphim? Yeah. It's like they were once friends, but... Something happened. Yeah. All the more reason we need to find and talk with Margaret. A little girl can't have gone that far away. Let's look for her tomorrow around the city. <gasps> A scream? Right outside! Berserk when the moon is out. Could it be behind the murder streak? Huh? It's kind of weak. Oh! A wolf monster! She has resonance too? Dang. We're going after it! Come on, hurry! There's two of them? And... It's eating its own kind? Don't underestimate me! Oh, wait! Ah. Lila, is this a Rougarou as well? No, this is a Hellion breed wolf. It's a beast turned Hellion. It's agile, but open for attack after it moves. Rising Sand! Rock 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 Sand! R
What? Wh what is going on? Margaret? You can tell it's really me, even though my mom said I'm a monster. Of course, I know you're not a monster. No, but I became one because me and Wiggs got so angry. Wiggs became a super scary monster all of a sudden, and then killed the people in the city. I got really scared. <laughs> And so, I went to go see my mom, to get help, but then my mom... Don't worry, your mom is gonna come soon. Really? I... I'm so happy. Syndra, I sensed the presence of Hellions, and also a bit of nostalgia. I can hear Syndra's voice. Wakes, let's go to the Bells. Sindra will be waiting for us. Margaret. I could have stopped this if I hadn't run away. Sindra. All Margaret said was that there isn't a seraph enshrined in the sanctuary. I see. And so that must have been what led to the bullying. Yes. In the midst of the intensifying clash between countries, the Church has been disciplining their believers more strictly. It's gotten to a point where they've started to act hostile towards anyone else with conflicting values and beliefs. Even if it is just some child's nonsense. So that's the reason why you left. Out of utter disgust with humans. Shepherd Saray, please, could you give me just one more chance to protect the city? I'd like to, but that city is still... But she's willing to do it! Right? Yes. I won't have people speak of my friend as a liar. I've always thought that having resonance was a good thing, but I guess that's not always true. Once you can see with it, your world is never the same again. Depending on how you take it in, you could change for the worse. In the end, it is what you make of it. Everyone's got their own values, but different values bring conflict amongst the people. Humans and Seraphim effectively live in different worlds. No wonder it's hard to live in harmony with each other. It's the same for shepherds and humans. What's important is having the capacity to accept each other's differences. Right. We're separate beings in the end, after all. Besides, Resonance has nothing to do with this anyways. Those bullies are at fault. So you're willing to accept us then, Rose? Well, if something is real, it's real. May as well be positive about it. That's pretty smart of you. Especially considering you're Rose. Yeah, I told you not to talk inside my head! Why don't you just accept it? It's how we Seraphim are. Well, I think it's creepy! I'm entitled to my opinion! <laughs>